How's it going, people? I'm not exactly sure what section I'm on. I've lost my damn book marker. I was skimming ahead, and I I think I'm on 26. I, 36. I think I'm on 36. See, I got a little uh, dilemma. No internet at home. And... Not much hard drive space, so I'm putting videos up and deleting them. I have an external hard drive. I put some videos on. I save some videos on there, but mostly I don't give a shit. If they all disappear tomorrow, I just make more, and they'd be a little better, hopefully. I think I'm on 36, but I'm not sure. I can't check on the internet, and it's no longer on my hard drive. Pour a beer and think about that. I don't know if there's anything to drink in this. I I have not read this section previously, so we're going to discover it together. Isn't that neat? I'll go slow until it's time to speed up. Revelation given through Joseph Smith, the prophet, to Edward Partridge. I'm pretty sure I remembered reading that. So, that was a clue. December 1830. See heading to section 35. So even the headings count. Yeah. The recipient instructed to preach. Every man may be commissioned in the ministry if he will comply with the Lord's requirements. And that's it for the masthead or the the um, uh, the heading. One, thus saith the Lord God, the mighty one of Israel. Israel's kind of a small place. Yet he's a God of the fucking universe, the multiverse. And yet he just hung up on Israel. Uh, mostly. And where there are people kissing his ass. Because you must keep track of them. All right. Sorry, went off on a tangent there. <laughs> Behold, I say unto you, my servant Edward, that you are blessed. We're going to tell you how much in a minute. And your sins are forgiven you. If they've got the authority to, then it's true. Yeah, you're not guilty of anything you ever did. That wasn't right. Isn't that nice? Gone. Magic eraser. And you are called to preach my gospel. And the voice... Of a trump. You know, Son of Sam's a preacher. He's bringing people to Jesus all the time. He just sent a few people there directly. Hopefully they were with Jesus. Or they're burning in hell and he's going to heaven. David Berkowitz, a little fucked hard. Two. And I will lay my hand upon you. By the hand of my servant, Cindy Ridgeton. Sounds like a circle jerk. <laughs> and you shall receive my spirit. Because you didn't aim right, I guess. I am totally wrong. I need to drink beer just for that. That's my punishment. That was raw. 
lot than what I just said there. <sighs> okay. I atone for it. <laughs> you shall receive my spirit. Hope you brought it some Kleenex. Uh, the Holy... My spirit, the Holy Ghost. Even the Comforter. Yeah, he's all those. He's his own trinity. Which shall teach you the peaceable things of the kingdom. Three. And you shall declare it with a loud voice, saying, Hosanna! Blessed be the name of the Most High God. Four. And now, this calling and commandment give I unto you concerning all men. He might have meant universally, you know, all the humanity. Oh, maybe. Or maybe he just meant men. Five. That as many as shall come before my servants. Sidney Ridgden and Joseph Smith Jr. Embracing this calling and commandment shall be ordained and set forth to preach the everlasting gospel among the nations. Six, crying repentance, saying, Save yourselves from this untoward generation and come forth out of the fire hating even the garment spotted with the flesh. Ew. That's intense. Sounds like Texas Chainsaw Massacre or some shit, you know? <sighs> Disgusting, man. Seven. And this commandment shall be given unto the elders and my church, that every man which will embrace it with singleness, yeah, do that, <laughs> the singleness part, although I prefer to say bachelor, because it's more of a lifestyle. What can I say I love me? Plus <laughs> my with singleness of heart may be ordained and set forth even as I have spoken. Or something like that. Eight. I am Jesus Christ, the Son of God. You gotta believe that. Bang! Instantly authentic. Certifiable. Wherefore, gird up your loins and I will suddenly come into my temple. Even so, amen. Whatever the fuck that meant. <laughs> uh, you know what? I'm going to read 37 real quick. It's tiny. Here's the heading. Revelation given to Joseph Smith the Prophet in, in Sydney Ridgeton, December 1830. Herein is given the first commandment respecting gathering in this dispensation the future migration of the church westward, duties of the elders in strengthening the church. Your duty one, at first. Oops. Behold, I say unto you that it is not expedient in me that ye should translate any more until ye shall go to Ohio. Always on the move, sometimes with tar and feathers. 
run out on a rail. And this because of the enemy and for your sakes. Two. And again, I say unto you that ye shall not go until ye have preached my gospel in those parts and have gathered up the church whithersoever it is found and or especially in Coresville uh, Colesville or especially in Colesville for behold they pray unto me in much faith They're going to get something in their stocking. They were good. Three. And again, the commandment I give unto the church, that it is expedient in me that they should assemble together at Ohio. Against the time that my servant, Oliver Calgary, shall return unto them. Four. Behold, here is wisdom, and let every man choose for himself until I come. Even so, amen. I nice sign off. It's so indecisive. <laughs> Better than mine. <laughs> it's like a haiku. I, uh, I think I'm going to read some more of the BOM because we're in a new chapter and I can't resist. So, I might not upload this all at once. I don't know. I don't have internet. I gotta find hot spots. I'm the Wi-Fi bandit. Uh, let me know if you learned something. Because I'm really interested. Keep me informed. Peace. Fuck. Ow. Ow. Have a wonderful whatever the fuck it is you're having. Because it is my wish. And um, see you in chapter two of Ether, I hope. If not, bye. If you got this far. <laughs>